What's happening? We are Dead Earth, and you are watching Rob and John YouTube channel. Hit the bell and subscribe for more content. Okay, so Dead Earth. Dead Earth hails from Cleveland, Ohio. Um, I'm the singer, Jack Savage. Um, we have Mark Hardy on guitars, uh, Joe DeFrank on guitars, Bob Semantic on bass, and Jay Powers on the drum. Um, the band name uh, was something that I came up with a few years back um, after uh, uh, listening to the first Black Sabbath album. And, uh, you know, I was just looking at the cover and I wanted something that went back to that style of metal where the riff where the riff mattered and the lyrics meant something and um, you know with uh, with everything that was going on and and um, you know in the world today I, I figured you know Dead Earth is a is a killer name so I looked it up and I didn't see anybody else that had it and um, so we grabbed it um, as far as like the first concert I ever went to um, that changed my life. I went and seen Rush a long time ago at the old Richfield Coliseum. And um, it was unbelievable to see how three musicians uh, could just be that powerful and have that sound come out of three guys. They influenced me a lot growing up, especially the earlier Rush albums. All the World's a Stage and first Rush album, first few Rush albums actually. Um, the writing process, does it come easy for for us guys and is there sometimes uh, where we run into a mental block or uh, writing what uh, what motivates us and uh, you know to write a new song. With what's going on in the world today, um, we have a lot to write about. I really don't have a lot of uh, block, you know, when it comes to writing lyrics because there's just too much hatred going on in this world today and it's got to stop. And I feel that and I hope that the lyrics that we write and the music that we write is part of the solution and not a part of the problem. Um, this, thing, this, this We sing a lot about um, anti uh Racism, we are not big fans of racism. We're not big fans of sexism. And we sure as hell uh, don't like what's going on in the world today. Um, there's a lot of change that needs to come. And um, we have a lot, a lot to write about. And the, the new stuff that we are writing is, is very angry. And it does speak out about injustice and things that are happening. And um, that's, you know, that's part of what, what we are. I mean, we, we, we're from Cleveland. Cleveland's a pretty tough town, and it just got destroyed by riots. And, um, you know, we write about where we come from and what we see in the world. And we're, um, you know, we know that a lot of uh, the world uh, is going through a lot of the same stuff. So. Everything that we write pertains on a on a world on a world stage, not just locally or, or in in the United States. Um, what moment on stage realized you made it? I feel that satisfaction is the death of desire, and um, there's always goals that we set to go to the higher level. We haven't hit that higher level yet but we're working on it really hard. And um, so hopefully uh, doing this interview picks up, uh, you know, picks up a fan or two and, uh, you know, give us a, a listen and uh, check us out. Um, we do have an album out called Truth Hammer. Uh, if you're interested, definitely pick it up. I think it's something to, you know, something to check out. Um, I thank you very much for uh, the opportunity and, and uh, to do this uh, interview and for uh, everybody out there who's listening and uh, keep supporting uh, original music because without you we wouldn't exist. Thanks man. Check it.